Hey, what is up YouTube? It's Adam back here, and today I have another video. Uh, first off, I'm sorry for not uploading lately, uh, just because I haven't really had time to. Um, but, yeah, I also have kind of stopped working on figures almost all together. I finally finished this one. I've started Arf Trooper Hound very subtly, and I'm also doing a bunch of other figures. So, yeah, I also got some new testers paint, one of which I'm using on this figure. If you can't tell already, but, um, I got, like, a tan, this blue color that I'm using on this, uh, some greens, and I also got this clay. Um, I'm using it just for practice right now, so I don't waste the air-dry clay. Um, but, yeah, so, that is that. And this figure, I named him Commander Sky uh, because of the sky blue color I used with him. He is a very nice figure. I literally just finished him about 10 minutes ago. Custer's paint is, the blue is definitely dry. The orange I'm not sure about, but I'm not, I don't think I'm going to touch the figure really, but Anyway, um, he is using an ARF Trooper helmet, he also has two Rex pistols, and he is featuring a cape, which I will get into further detail later, um, but the helmet, it is painted all throughout this bottom part, all the way around, and on the sides here, and then on the top. There are two orange lines, uh, pretty cool, and they add that nice little detail and mix up of color. Then the whole top part is painted this baby, or the, not the baby blue, the sky blue. And, yeah, so next, the four pieces of plastic on this, on his, um, uh, on his... <laughs> chest, I guess you can call it, or his stomach, I don't know, and, um, they are painted, like, three quarters blue and, like, a quarter orange, well, however you want to see that, um, but, yeah, so then on the back, he, there's a V, basically, and then the little part right there is full orange, um, pretty cool. Uh, I always forget about back detail, so I figured I would actually do some. And then there's some, uh, there's a chest plate that is painted, uh, this sky blue. So, also, like I said, his, um, pistols, they probably, they were the best weapon to go with this figure. I tried out all the weapons, see how they'd look. This... But, I mean, who doesn't look good in the, with Rex pistols? But, um, yeah, so he, on his arms, three pieces of metal armor on each arm. Top shoulder pad is painted uh, the sky blue. Bottom two are painted orange with the orange testers paint. Um, very nice. And the bottom cape kind of comes around the front a little bit, you can see. And then he also has uh, orange shoulder pads. Here, um, we get a better view of the cape. There we go. Uh, I can switch this light on and off. I will leave it like that for now, since you can see it a little bit better. Uh, tell me which one you guys like. Also, don't forget to leave suggestions for figures. I've been kind of running out of ideas lately. I was thinking about a Commander Fox Phase 1, um, but I'm not sure. So, like I said, the knee pads are painted orange. There's a cape, and yeah, um, this figure turned out really good. Uh, I just absolutely love this sky blue color, and I'm definitely going to be using it on more figures in the future. I also, if you stuck around watching this long, I also just ordered 20 clone troopers um, on their way right now, 
So I'll probably do an unboxing of that. I think that's my largest clone trooper order. But anyway, so that's pretty much it. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more. And this is goodbye, and have a nice day.